Dr. Seuss's How the Grinch Stole Christmas is one of the most popular Christmas stories that follows the Grinch who lives this cranky, solitary life and attempts to steal Christmas, but in the end, he realizes that it's not all about money and presents, and it really is a shot at the reality of the commercialization of Christmas. But do you know who the Grinch character is based on? It's actually based on Dr. Seuss himself, the author. He claimed that he was the inspiration for the character as his wife's health problems and his dismay with the commercialization of Christmas made him feel, quote, very Grinchish as he looked in the mirror one year on December 26th. Don't we all look in the mirror and see that same thing sometimes? I mean, maybe we don't commercialize Christmas, but we do have a habit of periodically prioritizing possessions or other worldly things over people and maybe even God. But ironically, not only is Christmas extra tempting to focus on stuff more than people, it's also one of the times of the year where people need the care and attention the most given that depression and stress are high around the holidays. The life and promises of Jesus show us an exact picture of someone whose focus was on the needs of others. And his promises offer us healing, they offer us help, and they offer us hope. And this Sunday, we're going to talk more about it. Hope to see you there.